In this tutorial we're going to look at how to create captions in Articulate Storyline 360. You can see I have a video playing and it's previewing. And down here we have a captions button on the player. I'm going to click that and you can see that I have the captions displaying that right there. And then I can click it and turn that off. So let's go ahead and see how we do that. So the first thing you want to do is insert a video. And then um, once you select the video, go up to Options and you'll see that you have some caption options here. And what we're going to do is we're going to import uh, our captions. Now I went ahead and created the captions uh, somewhere else and I exported that as an SRT file, which is a standard uh, file format. But we're going to go ahead and import that and see what happens. So here you can see my captions file. You can see that there's a number of file types that you can import. This happens to be an SRT, uh, but you can import one of the other files as well. So we're going to select that. We're going to open that. And now that's imported into Storyline. So how do I know that? Uh, the first thing is say I can just preview this. So if I preview this slide um, and I click on the captions, I'll start to see my captions there. The other thing you can do is you can click on Edit Captions and that will show the captions editor. And then inside of there you'll see the captions that you just imported. So that's how you import your captions. So you have to have uh, your caption file already created. A lot of times people create that outside of the authoring tools. And that makes sense. Like if you're using a really long video, uh, sometimes it's just easier using a captioning tool. Personally, I like to use YouTube. I just upload it, uh, insert my script, and YouTube kind of matches everything together. And then I can clean it up a little. Then I can export it. And then I have my caption file that I can bring into Storyline. So if you have a caption file and you have your video, just insert your video insert the caption file and you're going to get everything working the way it should.